I'm having a movie day. So basically, I'm gonna go make some make some movies, watch some movies. I usually make movies, but now I'm watching them. What a surprise! Yeah, come on, my mama told me one day I'm gonna grow up big and I'm gonna be a king. And my papa told me it's okay to say what shit hurts. Don't forget your dreams, cause they'll get you through this. So called life, they call living, but I call it strange, and I bet I'll do it. Cause I'm on my way, and strong enough that yeah. I can shake the pain. Hey. It just sounded amazing, so I was actually I'm not even halfway through the song, and I really love it. Called bipolar sunshine, I think, by Rivers, or it's called Rivers by bipolar bipolar sunshine. We're gonna go see Baby Rosie. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like Baby Rosie? I'm sorry. Now I'll never get it off of her. You know that, right? You may think it's mean. <laughs> but I need to get it off of her because I need to go. Do you want to piggyback? Yeah. Okay. Come on. No. Come on. Nah. Oh, oh wait. <laughs> I just tried to snatch it off of her, but it didn't work. Bye, Scarlett. Say bye. Bye. I can admit it. I'm 13 and I'm worked way too hard. <laughs> well, I'm not. It's just... Uh, I... There's only so much my body can take. On Monday, it's okay. Tuesday, I'm running downhill yet again. And every single weekday... It just goes down a little Friday. <laughs> Complete exhaustion. exhaustion. Now the weekend is my time off. A place where I can get about two hours extra sleep. But then on the other hand, I sometimes don't get extra sleep because I go to bed later. Like the time now is... 25 to midnight. So technically, I don't get the same amount. I, I get about 20 minutes more sleep or so. Yeah. Because I sleep in a little bit extra. But, you know, it never really happens. On, on weekends, I just cannot have the lay-ins. I don't know how to do it. Don't know how it's possible to sleep in. Don't know how other people do it. The only time I can possibly sleep in is if I had no sleep the following night, and sometimes I can't even do that. But yeah, on other news, I had a great time at my uncle's. It was quite fun. Saw my step cousins and my cousin, Baby Rosie. She's very cute, and um. She smiles and laughs now, even though she's about a month or two old now. It's quite amazing. It's amazing to watch people grow up. I mean, I feel so strange how in ten days I will have been on this earth for 14 years. I mean, I feel like I I just don't know what to feel like because I was I'm so amazed whenever I get to a birthday I just think to myself 14 years I've lived through my entire year I've done my entire years through 14 years 
And now I think to myself, what have I done during that 14 years? Wow. I feel like I can live what I dream. Okay. I I have set goals for myself and I want to complete them goals. I am going to live like I am sleeping. I don't I don't get a lot of sleep, like I explained a little while ago. I'm not an insomniac or anything, I just can't lay in. Think about it. Getting that lay in makes you dream a little bit longer. But why lay in when you can dream anyway? You can be in real life whilst you're dreaming. How sweet and amazing would that be? Yeah, exactly. Exactly what I was thinking. Pretty damn cool. Now I'm not the sort of person to get all political and stuff, but I really... Wait, why would me being political count as anything? Oh, anyway. Um... Uh... I, um, I think to myself, every single day I wake up, I think, what makes us walk? What makes us talk? And then whenever I see this camera in front of my fa face, I think to myself, right, so when I'm older, what will I do with all of this footage? What if YouTube sh shuts down one day? I I can see myself in 40 years, a 54 year old, just sitting there, uh, and then saying, I remember when I was younger, and I used to do this thing that was cool at the time called vlogging, I, I did it for five years, <laughs> and it was really cool, and I think, how long will I continue vlogging? I mean, if Atards did it for five years, but with them being like this every single day, where it's just me laying on my bed talking about how things have been, I just I don't really know. But the thing is, I have something new to talk about every single day, and now that I've started talking, I could talk for hours about this. I could continue some subject and subject and subject, but like I said, exhaustion. 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 I just need relief. I want to know why I'm here. Why was I... Why was I out of so many people brought onto this earth? There's seven billion people on this earth and... I was one to survive for 14 years. How long can I survive? It's the battle of the fittest and the battle of who can survive in the reality? Who can survive when they come out of the darkness? Oh my. I don't want to be. I don't want technology to be too advanced. I hate it. I was brought up in a house with little money most of the time. But then I have all of this stuff. And the reason I have that stuff is because I work for it. But I look at all of this technology sometimes and I just think to myself, why do we need that in our lives? What is that going to get us anywhere? There's so many people that sit on their asses every single day and just sit there and play video games 24-7. I mean, most of them don't even sleep. Some of them don't eat and drink. They just sit there, constantly glued to a screen. No, I'd hate to sit and live my life like that. 
I have to go out and do stuff. That's why sometimes I get disappointed when Gwen and Rowan don't want to come outside. I just think to myself, why? Why don't want you, why don't you want to come outside? I'm really disappointed because ever since Quinn got that blackberry, all he's been doing is, whenever we want to make a video, he's just pulling out the blackberry and looking at it. We are the, his friends there. He doesn't need his friends on the other side of our county to be messaging him. He doesn't need to stay in contact all the time. If he wants, send a freaking pigeon. Okay? I... Oh, oh. I just get really wound up. Uh, we rely so much on technology now, it it's just ridiculous. And why put so much money into gaming and things when we can help people with that money? I mean, millions of pounds go to chan cancer research every single year, but then millions of pounds go to gaming and stuff every single year. Yes, okay, maybe we can't find the cancer research, but maybe with all of that all of that um money that we're wasting in entertainment for ourselves. Relatively a little bit of entertainment is okay, but taking it all to the next level, taking it all oh, next gen consoles, next gen this uh, this console is five hundred pounds for you to buy. Why spend five hundred pound on it? You're just hurting yourself. You're hurting your bank card. That money could be doing something useful. Instead, it's just making you turn into a slob. That is my opinion. If you don't like it, I'm sorry. Anyway, guys, this has been uh, vlogging faces. A very long vlog, but this is, I just wanted this little rant. Of lots of different things to come out of my mouth. <laughs> anyway, guys, TDFN. Pull my heart out of my chest, train my mind so I forget. Sink your teeth into my bones, dig me out, then fill the hole.